everyone in Mandrel Land and the Government Mule family. I thought I'd give you a quick update of what's been going on in the Mule Smiles. It's been uh, up and down, uh, we've been the mixing today. <laughs> Things to and setbacks all the time through there. Uh, in January I had the uh, chest infection that uh, took away a couple of months. Then in February, good news, we had uh, Tom back for a bit, so we did a bit of the Snow Moon album, writing new album, recording piano and stuff. We'll show you that bit. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> oh yes, Tom. <laughs> oh yes, wow, Tom. Is that alright? Is that it? Yeah, I think that was cool. <laughs> really good. Right, it's right on. Feel cool. Slam a few notes on it. Just slam it on a few notes. <laughs> Brilliant. Right, a little bit of melody over the uh, yes. chorus. Yeah, Nothing definitely both of them for this one. Something yeah. sort of long and floaty. Long and floaty. Sweet, did you get that? Yeah. Cool. Nice. I probably don't think I could have done that any better. Cool. <laughs> probably want to use that same run over all the other cool. ones. Cool. Well. Do it, do it. It's real nice. Yeah. Nice one, Tom. And in March for Easter time, Lincoln come back and he drummed some on the snow moon. And uh, he also brought this very big uh, bug, which did this. A huge chest infection and all that malarked. It took six weeks to get over that. Blimey out, no. It took a long time, man. Uh, it's affected all the family. It affected Carl at the studio. It affected Lincoln. It affected all of us. This ambulance ride here is actually taking me to the hospital on Easter Sunday day. <coughs> Bloody hell, eh? Now, Government Mule are here, but the Mule's Smiles album is not ready, but I've got my tickets for Bristol, but I don't know if they're gonna actually be used yet. You'll have to wait and see, and I'll have to wait and see. It's a big thing, because, uh, the after effects of the infection, chest infection, went to uh, my brother Dave, he caught it. And my brother Dave has cystic fibrosis, which is a uh, chest condition. It's a gen genetic condition that affects the chest and the stomach, the digestion, uh, all sorts of things, bones. Uh, and it ended up putting him in hospital and he got a collapsed uh, upper chamber of his lung. Oh, it's been a been a dicey old time. Now, because of the way I am with the old Emmy and all that, I, I need Dave to drive me there. So, will we make it to the mule? You'll have to wait and see. Like, I will have to wait and see. I've heard that Joe McGlowan, our good old mandrel Joe McGlowan, is going to blow the saxophone with mule in at the London show, so... Uh, expect to see video of that. Won't be me videoing because I'm not going to that one, but 
<laughs> uh, but Joe, yeah. Hopefully Warren will get the Looney Strawberry Moon, the Rainbow Mandrel's third album. Because uh, he hasn't had that yet. He's had the Obelisk and Dome first one, the Diaspora Dilemma the second one, but he hasn't had the third one yet, so at least that buys me some time. And the really excellent news from the music gods out there that's shining down on Pete. Uh, <laughs> uh, Warren is bringing his Ashes and Dust band back to the UK in July. Now, he's coming the furthest down south of the UK he's ever been yet, and he's coming to Southampton, which is just the city, it's the port city of how to get to the Isle of Wight, so it's absolutely brilliant. So now the Mule Smiles album, with all the delays of the bugs, the Tom coming back, Lincoln coming back, so we had to write new stuff during when we weren't having a bug, we now have enough little slot between summer sessions of Mandelness to get the uh, Mule Smiles mixed and get it ready for July, hopefully. Uh, and the summer months will bring back Joe and Lincoln to record the Snow Moon album, which is uh, an album that was all written in February. And the Purple Worm Moon album, which is all in honour of the brilliant Prince, who is a major influence on uh, me as a writer and everything. So that's an update of what's going on in Mandelland and Mule Smiles. There is delays, but we're getting there. We've started mixing this week. And will we make it to the mule? You'll see in future episodes of uh, if there's footage or not. Might be able to borrow some of your friends. Nick, thanks Nick. If we can't get there, Nick will sort us out. Yay! Thanks Nick and Glenn. Have a great time. Everybody in the UK Mule family especially, have a great time this tour. The Rainbow Mandrel. Pure and seeing new sights with such fascination. <laughs> 